frustration with us trying to, to learn. Um, like there's several things I learned this weekend that you know the other more experienced commissioners would know about. But um, you know, keeping us informed of things that go on in your district. Uh, some of us may be more, more informed than others. I don't want to know every time you get a little sneeze in your district or something. I'm not talking about that. But if there's a, you know, a to see if he can get a different response and play you and me against one another. You know? So we, we really have to keep communication lines open because I, I know that that's well, I think a also, trash issue and things like that. You know? so we just, I think also along those lines is that you also have to fall back and depend a lot on staff. I know that's what I do. If, if I get a call <coughs> from a constituent out there and if I know I don't have the answer, not just the answer I think they want to hear, but the answer that's the what we're doing and more importantly put this loss this loss behind us because to me that's the only way we're going to really be able to bridge the gap with the community if the leaders can't come together you know the community we can't expect them to be together and i thank you for what you're doing uh, chairman i thank you uh, Joe, for what y'all are doing um, but you know at some point somebody's going to have to and then the city act like adults because I, I tell you it's, it's so disappointing you know, to, to hear citizens talking about the, the, the beef between the city and the county. You know, I work for the city, you know, and um, I've heard it for years. And you know, I just I just want peace. 